Hey folks, how's it going? Robert here. Christine too. We're out uh, doing a bit of rabbit hunting and snowshoeing. It's my birthday. I'm the big 4-4 today, so this is what we're doing for my birthday. So we're out doing some snowshoeing. Cool, eh? First time Christine's ever been on snowshoes, but uh, the snow is not too deep, so it's not going to be too hard on her. So we're going to see if we can get some rabbits out here. Uh, the woods is absolutely beautiful today. Beautiful. There seems to be all kinds of rabbit tracks, so... Hopefully we'll see something. Just using a pellet gun today. So, anyway, if we get one, we'll show it to you. Christine's getting her base for her fire. I'm gonna go like a little bit smaller tinder. A few small pieces here and there. What are you doing there? Taking some of my lip trap. Okay, but it's my good lip trap, so I'm not using nope. it on there, but. Directly on the dryer lint. Cool. Take that whole pile with the small stuff on the bottom, put it directly on the top. Yep, just like that. There you are. Beautiful fire. Yeah. The old dryer lint can't beat it. I won't throw it out the garbage anyway. That's right. Toasty, toasty one. Well, it wasn't like I was saving dryer lint. I just took the dryer lint out of the dryer this morning. Yep. That's a pretty roasty fire you got going here. A little Miss Lady. Holy Jesus, you're putting sparkies on me. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's all right. It's part of the part of the fire making business. Holy. You said make fire. Ooh, it's a nice fire. You see, you didn't even have to take your snowshoes off. What do you think of them? I like them. Yeah. Not too heavy or anything? Nope. I thought they might be a bit heavy, like walking in boots that are too heavy. You know yeah, they're not, though, eh? No. No. You're good, you're good. Thank you to Suzanne for loaning me these boots, because holy crap, my feet are not cold at all. Sweet. Gotta love the winter for putting fire out. <laughs> Just that easy. What? I like that camouflage color pattern of them. Yeah. Yeah. Perfect pattern for the winter time. Yeah. What? Oh, shoes on. 
That was a workout. <laughs> 20 pounds over Christmas, hard on a fella. People think that the snowshoes are only good for use in, when you got deep snow. Well, they're not really. The biggest thing about snowshoes is that they give you a bigger footprint on the ground so you're not doing so much sliding around. Your foot don't give you really a lot of traction when you're trying to walk in loose powdery snow. I mean, there's probably only uh, maybe six inches of snow on the ground, but it just makes walking so much easier. So, and even in real deep snow, unless you've got like old fashioned type snowshoes, it makes uh, going through deep snow really difficult until you get a trail beat down. Once you have a trail beat down, it's, it makes it a lot easier. It's like crossing stuff like this, same as crossing swamps and stuff. You got the snowshoes on, your feet are never getting wet. So that's one of the benefits of having snowshoes. There's all kinds of rabbit tracks out here, but I'm not seeing any rabbits. There's a bunch of tracks there. They're just everywhere in here, but... Are they fresh yet? No, not real fresh. Still covered in, eh? Yeah. Good exercise after Christmas, though. Burning off some of these Christmas calories. Yeah, well, I've been sweating more than once today, I'll tell you. Whew. Beautiful scenery, though. Sun's starting to get out, it's about 3 o'clock in the afternoon, 10 after 3. Anybody in there? Nope. Any rabbits under there? Oh, I don't see any. I thought maybe I was going to have difficulty wearing these rubber boots and these snowshoes, but uh, really they're not, not bothering my feet a bit. They feel quite comfortable on there. They do. Quite impressed with them. Pretty bad when even I can't wear gloves, but it's too hot. Yeah. yeah. Across and stuff like this, swampy wet ground, There's nothing to it with snowshoes on. What do you need? <laughs> the five C's. Five C's of what? 
survival. <laughs> That's right. What are they? Oh, I don't want to say. It. Come on. Come on. A cotton tool, <laughs> combustion cover, cordage. container, and cordage. That's right. Yeah. Five C's of survivability. God, it's beautiful country out here. It is. Beautiful. Winter finally hit us here in Nova Scotia. I love it. I'm going to need two hands to drive, so. Because it's slippery. <laughs>